Let's say grace for this Christmas dinner. Tommy, would you like to do the honors because you're the youngest? Mom, I'm 25, all right? Jesus! No, Tommy, no. I pray for you on Christmas Eve for an Xbox Kinect system under the tree. And that's not, that's not one of those cheap knockoffs they sell. It's spelled K-I-N-E-C-T. And if I don't get it, if I don't get it, then God, you help me, I will take down Santa Claus. I will take him down. Tommy, you know Santa's very busy at this time. You can't get everything you want. What? What, Ma? No. I was promised a Kinect system, and I'm going to get one. No one promised you a Kinect system. It was implied. It was a verbal agreement and written on a letter that was directly sent to the North Pole. Well, I don't know if the mailman gave it to Santa Claus because he lives all the way in the North Pole and that's very far away. He better have! There is no other reason for him than to send my damn letter. So what you're telling me is that if I wake up tomorrow morning and there isn't a connect system under the tree, I should grab a letter opener and murder the mailman? No, 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 Tommy. I bet the mailman will deliver it just in time to Santa Claus. He better have! I'm just saying that you might not get everything you asked for. Ma! We are not doing this on Christmas Eve. If I wake up tomorrow morning and there isn't a connect system under the tree, then God help me and he will. I will burn this house down. Calm down, honey. It will be fine. Let him do what he wants, Sherry. He will burn down our house. I will burn it down. I've got matches. Now, Tony, calm down. Shut up, Grams. If I needed a history lesson or I had a big bread, I'd ask you. We only bring you out on Christmas Eve to listen to your crap. So shut your chimney hole before I shove a piece of coal down it. You cannot talk to Grandma like that. You know what you have to do? Make less noise when you and your boyfriends are in your bedroom. You guys shake up the whole house. God knows you slid down more pipes than St. Nicholas himself. Don't talk to your sister like that. Mom! You are no room to interrupt us. This is an A and B conversation, so see your way out of here. Carl, do something. Do you see the way he's talking to me? Just let him do what he wants, Sherry. He's 25 years old. As you guys said, I'm the youngest and strongest one here, which means I have complete control. How does that make you in charge? God! You have no room to talk, Billy. You've gone through your third divorce this year. You've had more ho-ho-hos than Santa Claus himself. I heard Mom and Dad talking yesterday, and they want you out of the house. For God's sakes, you're 26 years old. Every morning, I wake up to make myself a sandwich, and I find that all the fat-free mayonnaise is gone. What do you do with it, Billy? Only God knows. I think that we all need to calm down now. You're right, Ma. We all need to calm down and come to the important fact of the matter. Of my Xbox! I need an Xbox, Ma. We both know I have mad kung fu skills. I can put down the streets in front of the screen. I'll be taking out criminals from the streets and fighting them. I'm the best, Ma. I'm the best. All right, all right. You might get an Xbox. I goddamn better. And he will damn. I will stand in front of that chimney the whole night and wait for that fat bastard co to come down with a Microsoft Xbox Connect system. And if he doesn't, then God help me and he will, I will burn this house down as stated above. There is no Santa Claus. What? Ma, are you hearing the filth coming out of your husband's mouth? Especially on Christmas Eve? You need to control him. Shut up, Tommy. There is no Santa Claus and the North Pole is a myth. And the mailman too? I hate all of you guys. I wish I was Jewish. <laughs> this happens every year. There goes Tommy. You did get him a connect system. Yeah.